Hello there everyone, this is Neko Knight here, getting ready to play Planet Crafter. So I will tell you this, I'm in the developable, development branch or whatever the hell you want to call it, and they're bringing in some things that I was just talking about in my last video. Uh, one of them is, you can now build on rocks. You know how I was uh, complaining about, like, on rocks you had to build your structure above? over here yeah they fixed that and there there's this update that they've got planned has quite a few nice t tidbits to it so as you can see here i use i had to build above the ground and if i take the oh um here we'll just whee, take this one and you'll be able to see I can now build on the rocks. Now another fun bit is depending on the tree seed planter you use, uh, trees will spawn within a certain uh, section of the place. So I'm not sure what that means, but I think that means, for example, let's see. I don't know how far the tier 3 spreads, but we'll just say, oh, for example, like this over here. You can see all these trees here were not here before, but they are now. And they're a copy of these trees here. So that's one of the new things they've done. Uh, which is actually kind of cool. It makes the world even more or less barren, in other words. But at the same time, what happens if you remove that tree and put a new tree in? Will that disappear all of these and regenerate new ones? Or will new ones spawn there? Or will new ones just spawn next to those? And will they just multiply until... yeah. Another fun bit that they added is, I was talking about like how it would be nice to have these to snap. Well, they, it, it well, it, it does snap, but it doesn't snap the way I wish it had snapped. So now you can take a farm like this, which uh, you can't build in the air, surprisingly. You can build on the ground. Uh, the way it snaps is like this. You put it here and it snaps in with the other one. The, the way I wanted it to snap was that, let's say, uh, the foundation here. Now let's say you can place this thing on the corner here. It's like, but I don't want it to be there. Or maybe I want it to be more... Bugs, stupid thing, but maybe I want it to be more centered. As you can see here, it hangs off the edge, uh, but maybe I wanted it to snap into here. So it's a nice. This is nice. It's actually uh, I like that you can snap them all together. So if you get one that's like near perfect, like this, you can snap them all together like that. But. Actually, can you snap them off, like... Yes, yes you can. And you can... Adjust it. Admittedly, it looks weird as hell, but hey! Again, I'm in the develop <laughs> development branch, so... We're gonna come across uh, quite a few interesting bugs and stuff. Another... Oh yeah, speaking of... Uh, weird positions. <laughs> sideways farm you can have a sideways farm I don't know why you would want that but um yeah so we're gonna I'm gonna leave that like that for now so now that we've been covering all that and the tree thingy another thing uh, that they did which is nice but at the same time I kind of wish it was a little bit sooner the drone station it used to be like way up in here somewhere 
they dropped it to way down in here. So you get the rod, the fuse, and then the drones. Which, I was thinking about it, and now I would have liked it to have been after the autocrafter, but then, if you get the autocrafter and the drones, you won't really need the teleporter. You, you, can, effect, you can effectively run where the hell you want, set up the drones, and then just never go back through there again, ever again. So, I guess this is about a decent spot. The other thing is, they introduced a thing called the ecosystem. We're gonna have to get up to that point to figure out what the hell that is. But, uh, from what I read in the notes and what it says in the ecosystem, it produces larvae and increases plant levels. The problem is, what type of larva and how many spaces? Because, if it does, if it's a little section that only generates two at a time, then it'll just be better to pick up the larva off the ground. Now, if it generates like 10, you got like 10 spaces and it generates like two of each larva guaranteed, it might be worth building without a doubt. Now, another thing I would like to see is an upgraded tree bark thing or or now that they've introduced the mechanic where trees spawn like this randomly out here we have the option to come up to them and we can click on them and de or we have a de deconstruct tool and we can de destruct them and gen we can pick up bark from them that way so we come along and be like bark 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 and uh, that would be kind of cool because then that would allow us to more choose how we want our plants and where we want them and they introduced the new biome so we're gonna be heading over there i just wanted to talk about all that and uh most of you probably already scattered but still all right Sideways farm. Uh, the new, if you look on the map here, there's a place over here. If you're wondering how to get into it, uh, I, I know one way to get in there, and uh, that's about it. There might be another way up in here somewhere, which actually, oh, ooh, I didn't know about this. You can press the WASD and move your thing around smoothly. Is this a new... Is that new? I never bothered to try. So, up over... This might be a cheating way, so we're gonna go and try and figure out the regular way to get in. Or at least the, the non-cheaty way. Although, I mean, if you've got a jetpack, it's not cheating. The developers can easily put a wall if they wanted to. But before we go, let's go eat and drink. I don't feel like dying exploring the new zone. Alright. We gotta get more fuses, more other things. Oh, I didn't know the underside of this was see-through. Huh. Alright. Food. Drink. And let's go. We'll get over there at some point in like 20 years. They've also been making slow improvements to the terrain and a few other things as they go along. I am curious what else they're going to do and what other balances and changes they're going to make. But definitely got to check out this new zone. So we're going to rush on over. I do actually some other things I would love to see is higher tier uh, jetpacks. I know I'm not at tier 4 yet, but if we could get like tier 10 and where we can just zip along, that would be fun too. Because I don't have a teleporter, so... The, the, ooh, those are different, different trees. I thought the entrance was going to be over here. The entrance might be over there. 
Yeah, it looks like the trees, the dominant trees you have out are going to be the ones you've planted. And I did not know they would spread this far. Yeah. Alright. So, oh. That's it. That's the entrance. Over here to the left of this is the entrance. You can see the dust coming off this. This will be quite interesting to see. Middly, uh, I don't know if I'll be doing another playthrough. Depends on how much they add, and, and but I might still do little tidbits. Oh. Oh yeah, they added explosives. So now you need, can be destroyed with explosives. I have a, what the hell? Ow. This is one hell of a place. We're getting a screenshot. There we go. So you need explosives to get in here naturally by the looks. Is it? I don't know if I would want to drink this. Although, I mean, I've drank purple water. Uh. Yep, I, ha I had to drink red water too. Might as well. Alright, is there anything in here in the water that might be worth exploring? Oh, and uh, another thing is, is they changed the, whatever you call it. Oh, 3.6. Uh, they changed the endings to make it sound happier. Because a lot of people found the endings to be rather depressing and sad. And, uh, it's all down to your interpretation, really. So far, I'm not seeing anything like... That's... Is that the second way? No. That's the way I came in. I'm not seeing any gold chest. I'm not seeing anything special. And... What about the waterfalls? Anything special here? No. What about going up? Anything special going up them? I don't think so. Oh. Oh, there's a there's a new wreck. A new wreck. Ooh, a chest. It's, it must be because it's develop development. That's why this has nothing. Pretty sure. Because this is absolutely my very, very first time exploring here. Like, very first time. Ooh, there's a bunch of them in here. How do we... Do we just climb in here? Yes. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. Super Torch! Uh, I will take that. Uh, I will take that and that, that and that. And, oops, I don't really care about the plants. Uh, oh, that barely, this barely has anything. Ooh, I will take those. Everything else here is meh. Uh, that was super meh. Let's see, we can pretty much trash some of this and store it back, but for now... Alright. I'm curious if there's anything more. Oh, they it removed the overtop. So you can see right there, that's where the entrance is. There might be another entrance up over here somewhere, so you, like, you come up around here, through here, up and around, and into here. We'll have to see. There might be more stuff, and I do know they were supposedly adding a couple more wrecks into the place. Well, that's apparently one of them. Even with the tier 3 torch, this is still not... Uh, another empty chest. Oh, 
There's a... How the hell did that one manage to... I questioned some of these wrecks. Like, how the hell did that manage to... Like, these trees... Ooh, super! These trees would have to be... Oops! Ow. We're gonna die. It's worth it. We're exploring someplace new. It's worth dying for. Plus, I probably should try and find a way out. I didn't expect to fall though and crack my bones. Okay, so... Whoop! Alright, in here? Oh yeah, they also uh, changed up some of the wrecks. So that you now have to... Uh, what do you call it? Use explosives in some of them to get out. Oh, tier three. Uh, we're going to see if we can, or not get out, but to open up some places. Ooh. Oh, this, right, the spacesuits. Um, they added some new spacesuits. I don't... Blasto? Blasto? Uh, I don't care about repeats. Actually, now that they've introduced spacesuits as a... Oh yeah, we're gonna... Uh, I would like to have a mannequin so I can throw the spacesuits onto it and just have them for decorations. Admittedly, I won't be using most of them, but still. Uh, we're gonna drop most of this. I'm taking that one without a doubt. I'm taking that and that. Nice to know that they put some spacesuits. So I found at least two spacesuits so far. We're gonna have to drop the iron. Hmm, I'll have to come back for that. Let's continue to explore. I am, wait, what? That's one hell of a mini chest. I mean, I, normally these have just a, what, whatever the hell you call it, uh, oops, I forget. Uh, they usually just have, uh, we can drop those and this. Normally they just are, they have one, wow, there's actually some okay stuff here. I can't carry it all. Oh, yes, mine. We're taking the production multiplier without a doubt. Uh, we'll come back for the rest of this. Uh, especially since we're going to die and teleport all the way back home. I would like to f figure out my way out of here. Without having to rely on, on explosives. But we may... Ooh, wait, what? There's two... Oh, there's sulfur. This one requires explosives. I'm gonna have to see where and what. At what point do we unlock explosives? And does it require, do we have to find them through the blue chips or do we have to find them uh, by Terra Index? Most likely this is all explosives requiring us to get in and out of here. Uh. Again, empty. So we can come in through the Iridium Cave by the looks of it here. I'm gonna have to as, as figure out where the hell to get the blue, uh, uh, not the blue, but get the explosives. And actually, I think we'll get another screenshot of this, uh, what was it, F2? Yes. There we go. There. All right, we're about to die. I wish I could find some food. I wish I I hadn't fallen on the ground either. Uh, I don't know if there's gonna be anything else special of here, and uh, we're definitely gonna have to open up the paths uh, normally. But that explosive uh, makes me curious, though. 
All right, we should be able to squeeze our way back out and around. Whee! And we're gonna die. Die, 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 because I fell on the ground too many times. Now you definitely do. It's a good thing they allow you to keep your jetpacks and stuff because uh, if you, they didn't, pretty sure you would get you would lose your stuff if you didn't. All right, we should be returning home pretty quickly. I'm gonna have to see if I got any blue chips hidden around, and if not, I'm gonna have to hunt them down. Sweet. All right, we're back eat drink oh yeah what was it three yeah three allows you to dance and all that and uh they they allow you to view part of your spacesuit the problem is i i wish i could actually get i don't know if there's a uh what is it Five, six, seven, eight. Nope. Not eight. Uh, nine. Whoop. Nope. Definitely not nine. Or ten or whatever. Uh, I wish I could get a, a orbital view because I would like to be able to see. But let's see. Right click to equip. I don't know what that means. Oh, oh, that's not right click, that's left click. Oh, I'm white. This is kind of why I would like to have a mannequin. So I'm assuming I take this one off and I put that one on and... Yeah! Admittedly, that's an ew color, so I definitely don't like that one. I do like this one, though. This, this one is... yeah. All right, uh, we qu covered quite a bit. We showed that you can now snap farms together. We talked about uh, some of the updates. We showed that the trees now spread depending on the tree spreader you put the trees you put in the tree the spreader. We talked about how you can now build in rocks. Thankfully, now we just got to wait for them to add more shapes, sizes and angles and then we showed the new location and we talked about a few other things we are going to keep playing and i am going to keep on the development branch and uh ooh, ooh, please pulsar yes pulsar chords perfect timing what a way to end this Alrighty, well if you guys enjoyed please like if you didn't i understand this was just covering the development branch and to see what we have. If you guys want to see more or see other games, check out my channel. And if you want to be added on to the in-screen credits like these people, make sure to publicly subscribe. After a certain amount of time, you'll be added on. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed and you come back for more. Uh, I'm going to let the time finish running for everybody. We're going to gather up. Ooh, that's where it's all. We're gonna, I'm gonna deposit some stuff and then we're gonna let everybody get seen. I probably should make that black or something so it can be easily seen at all times, but uh, oh well. Bye bye!